Okay, so today we're making slime, and for your materials, you're going to need a bowl, a mixing tool, glue, gainer tied, and a color. You can either use paint, food dye, or nail polish. For mine, I chose paint, and I mixed two colors together. I mixed pink and purple, and I got a violet. So... For the first step, you're going to pour in your glue, make sure you get it off, you can even take your mixing tool and get it out, make sure you get it off, okay, then you're going to get your color, you're just going to get like a little bit of a spoonful, you're just going to mix that in there. And you're going to want gloves, and you're going to want to do this in a place where it's not going to get too messy. Or where it's okay to make a mess. So, you can get more of a color if you would like to make the color more vibrant. And if you don't think you have enough, or it's not the color that you would like, you can have more so just keep adding until you get the color that you want. Okay, <coughs> just add more what you want. So I added a little bit of this in the colors. Okay. So now that you have that mixture base, it's all mixed in. Okay, so now that you have that mixture base, you're gonna add in a little bit of your activator, which is your gain or tide. I'm just gonna mix that up. Add just a little bit at a time. You can add a little bit more at a time. And make sure your mixing tool isn't too wobbly. Mine is wobbly, but it's all that I had. So it's okay. You want to have a strong mixing tool. The bigger the batch, the stronger you want your mixing tool to be. You can use any kind of mixing tool. You can use a popsicle stick, a spoon, a fork, anything. So I'm going to add more because it's so gooey. Mixing it. I usually add just a little bit of my spoon at a time. You can use both hands if you need to. It's easier actually to hold your bowl. If you get it on your hands, it should be okay. It will come off. And if you used food diet, it will not come off. Okay, so then you're going to mix. the rest of whatever you have. 
It's still not coming. Here we go. mixing. And if it's still running like this, I'm going to add more. So I, can, I don't have any more in my cup. So I'm just going to add what I have. So, I'm just going to keep mixing. And mixing. And just keep mixing. Okay, so you're going to keep mixing until it gets to about, right, I guess you'd say this kind of sensation, okay, it's kind of sticking, you're not sticking to your gloves, and you're just going to knead it, and you're going to make sure you get all the excess off of it. And if you still need to, you can that's still sticking like this, and you can add more. Just a little, not too much, like I just added it, just a little bit. I'm trying to get it. Yeah, I'm just going to So you're going to keep mixing it, and then once you have mixed and kneaded it all, it will eventually turn out to look. At this point, if it's not too sticky, you can take off your gloves. Just kind of like mix it with your hands. And if you want, you can just add a little bit of gain into your hands. And just put it on top of it. And then just kind of mix. Then once you are finished mixing and kneading it with your hands, those are not to look like that. You can play with it and do whatever you would like with it. So, yeah. And that is it.